Meantime, new data from the state showing the alarming number of COVID-19 cases at state-run facilities. Right now, there are 18 deaths and a total of 178 cases in those facilities, and that's among residents and staff. Orko Manis spoke to a staff member at one of those most impacted centers right here in Las Vegas, and it's a story you'll only see on 8 News Now. There are 38 positive COVID-19 cases here at the Horizon Health and Rehabilitation Center. That's the highest number of cases of any state regulated facility in Southern Nevada. I spoke to a staff member here who's shedding light on the situation. The staff member at Horizon Health and Rehab I spoke to did not want to be identified for fear of losing their job. They say positive coronavirus cases started to pop up at the live-in facility about three weeks ago. Once a patient tests positive, they're transferred to the acute hospital. According to a new dashboard just released Monday by the Nevada Department of Health and Human Services, 14 residents and 24 staff members at Horizon Health and Rehab have tested positive and one person has died. Anybody who is suspected or had been in a room with someone who had tested positive, they're over on the isolation area. In a statement to 8 News Now, the facility's administrator said their top priorities are their resident safety as well as providing their staff the ability to safely care for them and that they're screening each individual that comes into the facility for symptoms and only allowing essential personnel to enter. I'm told all residents and staff are being tested as the work continues. We love and we care for our patients and we're, we're doing the best with what we have. The staff member says there are more COVID-19 tests being conducted here and they expect the number of positive cases to go up. Reporting in Las Vegas, Orco Mana 8 News Now.